The first general to die in the Russian invasion to Ukraine was Lieutenant General Yakov Rozantsev. Lieutenant General Yakov Rozantsev was reportedly killed by a Ukrainian strike on the Chornobevka airbase near the city of Kherson. He was promoted to lieutenant general last year and was commander of the 49th Combined Army of Russia's Southern Military District. He is said to have taken part in Russia's military operation in Syria. Another Russian general to die in the Russian invasion to Ukraine is Major General Oleg Mityov. Major General Oleg Mityov reportedly died somewhere near the city of Mariupol, a city in southeast Ukraine which was the scene of a protracted Russian siege. The nationalist Azov regiment claimed to have killed him. He was a commander of the Russian Army's 150th Motorized Rifle Division, a relatively new unit formed in 2016 and based in the Rostov region close to the Ukrainian border. The third general to die in the Russian invasion into Ukraine was Major General Andrei Kolesnikov. Major General Andrei Kolesnikov of the 29th Combined Army was killed in fighting on March 11, according to official Ukrainian sources. The circumstances of his death were not given. After Kolesnikov became the third Russian general reportedly killed in Ukraine, one Western official told the press association that the Russian army may be suffering from low morale, which is why high-ranking military officers are moving closer to the front line. The fourth Russian general to die in Ukraine was Major General Andrei Suhovetsky. Major General Andrei Suhovetsky, a deputy commander at the same unit as Gerasimov, was reportedly killed by a sniper on 3 March. Like Gerasimov, Sukhovetsky was part of Russia's military operations in Crimea and in Syria. Unlike the other generals, Sukhovetsky's death was reported in the Russian media and Russian President Vladimir Putin confirmed in a speech that a general had died in Ukraine. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like the video for more breaking news.